everyone welcome back this is Shelly of letters by shells and today I wanted to go ahead and show you all how to upload photos into the procreate app this is a question that I get asked all the time and I just thought it would be a really cool way just to show you how I do this it's really similar to my other tutorial that I did on how to upload practice sheets it's like a very similar concept but there are some new things that I wanted to share here. So for this example, I'm gonna open a brand new canvas and open it up to five by seven inches. And afterwards, just go ahead and tap on that create button and you're all set. So once the Procreate app um, opened up that new canvas, I'm gonna go ahead and just tap on that wrench symbol and then it's gonna go to the actions and add and just click on insert a photo right there. And it's gonna access your photo library again and just choose the photo that you want to be imported. So the reason why I want to talk about this is because you'll see that the imported photo is not the exact same size as a canvas. So you can resize it. My favorite, I like to go to the very bottom right there and tap on fit to canvas and you'll see that it's stretched out the entire image and with that I'm just gonna move the points from the top and the bottom and just kind of stretch it out a little bit more and that way you're able to basically import that photo and now fill in that entire canvas size this is really good for like projects so for me I normally like to paint things and scan those in and basically import those watercolor pieces into the Procreate app and that way I'm able to letter on top of that painted image. For this example, I'm just gonna go ahead and use a stamp that I already made in the past and I also made a tutorial on how to make your lettering into a stamp as well. But basically for that, let's, let's just use a stamp so you can see like the overall picture. I'm gonna also always make sure to letter on a different layer. So the first layer was the imported image. So now opening up a brand new layer, you're able to now letter on top of the image and things like that. So there you have it. That's the reason why I love importing images. And just in case you were wondering, this is exactly how to do so. So thank you so much again for watching give it a thumbs up if you enjoy this tutorial and also comment below if you have any questions thank you so much again for watching see y'all next time bye